Welcome back, here is Dr. Vaughn um, with another video of Mass Effect 3. So I returned to the Citadel to speak with Ashley Williams, um, also with Tain Krios, and well, see what's around. Maybe we have uh, new places to, to go and um, shop. Listen, honey, please. This is how it has to be. Everyone's going through this. I know, and I'm sure you'll be fine. It's just so damn inconvenient. It's like we're pre-space white all of a sudden. Pretty much. You should see what they've got us using for heavy munitions. It's all mass-produced Elkos combine crap. Wait, munitions? Explosive munitions? I thought you weren't going to be on the front lines. Not in hot combat zones, no, of course not. But sometimes, they need us to breach enemy fortifications. Goddess, you said you were just going to be building emergency outposts. Well... A small lie to not preoccupy you more. Primarch Victus has requested a war summit of council races, and reports suggest he has also offered an invitation to the Krogan. Well, they're speaking now um, with new news. Asari Intelligence is reporting sightings of Reaper forces in the Salian Nebula and the Nimbus Cluster. Ilium is under attack. Although the Asari colony is across the galaxy from Palavin and Earth, the invading force appears to be the same that attacked those planets. According to the Council, these galaxy-wide attacks are part of a massive and organized invasion plan. The Council called the invaders Reapers. Okay, this is not new. I assume only about um, no, um, Victus, um, it was the, the only new thing, but well. Welcome, Commander Shepard. Please select the destination. Okay, so now we have more places, well, um, the city, the city of embassies and um, also the Huerta Memorial is it's what we had before, but now we have also the Purgatory Bar, uh, where we can meet Aria and some of the crew members that are chilling out. And also the Presidium Commons, which is like um, the largest place, uh, I believe, in the Citadel, in, in which we can purchase uh, weapons. So I'm going... Okay, I understand uh, elevator. So uh, yeah, going to the Citadel Embassies. And, yeah. No questions, thank you. Take me to the embassies. One moment, please. Now arriving at Presidium Embassy. But what I need is proof. I can't take your word on this. But those assumptions merely leave my son stranded in enemy territory. The Alliance military is the Hades Gamma Cluster to incoming Reaper forces. I fully understand the situation. Of course, I read through the names of the dead every day, but... Please! Please, a few more minutes of searching could mean a lifetime of peace for my family. Someone in your family is MIA? My son, Bilal. And bureaucratic compassion seems to be in short supply. I am Ambassador Dominic Osoba. My son's squad returned from their mission on Benning without him. I found them drinking, but they won't even look me in the eye. I can offer a bounty for any information. If Palau's alive, we want him home. If he's dead, then... then we can begin to mourn him. If I find anything, I'll let you know. Thank you. Either way, you will set my mind at ease. Hmm. Why 
Why do you refuse to help me? If it's possible that my husband Ralph is alive, I will not rest until he's found. didn't have the chance to marry you because of this damn war. But you're still family in my book. Nothing will ever change that. I... Of course, Teresa. I'll come back later during your break if you want. Treat you to lunch. What do you say? I would love that, Teresa. Thank you. Oh, it seems like uh, the old lady is um, off. Pretty off. Commander Shepard, John Dumbau, Special Tactics and Recon. I've got intel suggesting that high-level Hanar officials may be indoctrinated. That's a damning accusation. What have you got? Evidence of an Alliance Black Ops team raiding a Batarian research station. The Batarians were studying Reaper technology. The Batarians had Reaper technology? The Alliance raid turned into a massacre, and the humans ended up with nothing. Your people faked a power failure to hide the incident. The Batarians would have gone to war if they'd found out. But how does this implicate the Hanar? They maintained discreet grey market trade relationships with the Batarians, and led the Alliance to the station. We suspect those Hanar operatives escaped with Batarian tech. If your reports on the Reapers are accurate, they could already be indoctrinated. What's your source on all this? It was an anonymous gift, but I believe it came from a thief named Kasumi Goto. I've been after her for years. Kasumi? You're hunting a thief? A master thief. Her intelligence and skill are almost Solarian. I'm sure she'd appreciate praise from the Spectre who's chasing her down. I only need her data. I admire her personally. And since she sent me this, I assume her feelings are mutual. What do you need me to do? The Hanar operative is now a diplomat on the Citadel. I don't have a public name, and the Hanar will go to ground if I make a formal inquiry. So we're hunting. I'm tracking suspicious transmissions to the Hanar homeworld. I could use your help. Let me see what I can dig up at the Spectre office. Thanks, Shepard. And for the record, not everyone doubted your concerns about the Reapers. I just hope we're not too late. Kasumi Koto, an old friend. So, remember when you helped me get Keiji's Grey Box from Donovan Hawk? The one with information that could start a war? I thought we destroyed that information to keep you safe. There were enough clues left for me to piece things together when I got curious. It was big enough to leak it to Bao. If you don't mind me tagging along cloaked, maybe I can help you dig up some dirt on the Hanar. I'd appreciate it. Oh, I remember them. Daniel St. Donnelly. I'll try of course. I would love to, to have them back on the Normandy. enough money.
Shepard? I should go. I'll be here. I'm just checking if uh, there is anything new to, uh, to, to talk with him, but nothing so far. I don't think, I don't think there is anything new to talk uh, with Captain Bailey as well, so I'm just moving. Possible hits. Got some strange money transfers on Balone, and Alun is sending a lot of data. Balone's clean. His money transfers are to support his mistress. Not sure about Alun. I'll pull his bio. I'll check Alun's personal records and pull his recent messages. Can I just note how odd it is for Hanar to have a mistress? You know, if Bao catches up with you, I can grant you immunity. What? If I join up? Last time I did that, you wrote me into a suicide mission. I didn't say you had to join up. know what happened to to the son of this um, ambassador oh, it's not giving me an option to speak with them hey otherwise this is yeah this is um, amazing group with nice music it's not like Omega afterlife but I'll definitely put this as my second favorite place uh, in the trilogy I mean, it's a bar place. Thugs are here illegally. 
Yes, and it only took C-Sec three weeks to figure it out. I don't care who you are. You're required to go through processing like all other refugees. Come with me. I don't think so. Shirk, get me the Asari counselor. Greetings, Arya. Is there something you need? I'm being asked to submit to immigration processing. Of course you are. Done. What else can I do for you? Nothing. Thank you. My pleasure. I think we're done here. Enjoy the show, Shepard? I guess there's one rule on the Citadel, huh? I guess so. I hate this place. So sickeningly uptight. Then why are you here? Cerberus stole Omega from me. The elusive man is now squarely at the top of my ship list. He will pay for every second I've spent in this bureaucratic hellhole. How did Cerberus defeat you? Deceit, distraction, and a big fucking army. They lured me away from Omega and ambushed me. I escaped, but Cerberus had already laid siege. By the time I could launch an assault, they were too entrenched. At least you escaped to fight another day. And that day is coming. I'll take Omega back, but I'll get to that. You're here because I have a proposition. I'm listening. The way I see it, if you don't defeat the Reapers, we're all dead. Won't matter where I'm sitting. It's in my interest to help you. What are you offering, Arya? On Omega, I kept the Blood Pack, Blue Suns, and Eclipse in check. Now they're running amok. Nobody wants that. Unite them under my rule, and you'll have a powerful and ruthless force for your war. I've laid the groundwork with all three groups. I just need you to close the deals. Give a criminal a gun, he'll shoot you in the back. They already have guns, Shepard. I'll make sure they point them at the Reapers. I'm trying to help you. Why don't you think it over? Meet with Narl, my agent who's dealing with the Blood Pack. The Blue Sun's leader is incognito here on the Citadel. He'll be expecting you. And I already have a deal with Jonas Sedaris, the Eclipse leader. You just have to get your friend, Commander Bailey, to let her out of jail. You obviously don't know Bailey very well. Bailey respects you. Lean on him. I think a united force of professional mercs is worth it. Don't you? It's always a pleasure, Shepard. Let me know if you want to talk later. Well, we will need um, every possible force that um, we can, you know, find. Um, another thing about the Omega, it's uh, it's a DLC that um, so far I don't have. Um, probably I'll purchase so I can, you know, test it by myself and you can see um, play through of it. I mean, it's plenty of playthroughs in YouTube, but still. Um, if you're watching my series, it will be it will be interesting at least to revisit alongside uh, my Shepard um, Omega in Mass Effect 3. Look who's here. So what's on your mind, Shepard? What's your angle on gaining control of the blood pack? Narl will explain it. If we're going to work together, Shepard, you need to trust me, at least a little. How do we get the Blue Suns on our side? Their leader. Darner Vosk is a twisted little criminal. I expected his demands to be unreasonable, but it turns out he's the biggest pushover of them all. Talk to him. I'll let you be the judge. Call me if you need to. How am I supposed to talk Bailey into letting Jonas Sedaris out of prison? I've already leaned on the council. Bailey is in direct defiance of their order. So talk to him. One boy scout to another, chain of command and all that crap. Take him to dinner, talk dirty to him, whatever works. <laughs> talk dirty to him. Maybe I should send you, Arya, to talk dirty to him. What's new with you? That's supposed to be funny? 
Let's see. I've lost Omega. I got seasick eyes all over me, and I'm holed up in this poor excuse for a nightclub. Can't even get an ovarian rum here. In other words, I'm in hell. How do you plan on taking Omega back? I think I'm going to employ violence. I'm gonna slap Omega right out of the elusive man's greedy little hands. We'll talk later. I'm sure. Well, hello there. Hey, Commander. Nice to see you down here in the dirt with us grunts. You don't think I like getting dirty? Oh, now, come on. I didn't mean anything by it, Commander. Uh-huh. What'd you mean, then? See those Marines over there? None of them officers, just soldiers fighting a war. Yeah. They've been buying me drinks all night. You know why? Same reason they got all quiet and serious when you walked in. You don't seem intimidated by me in the least. In fact, you could use a little more deference. <laughs> sure, but I've fought with you. I've seen you in action. Now, don't get me wrong, you're good. Probably one of the best. Probably. But I know you're human, just like me. But not them? Nope. Hell, I still remember the day they made you the first human specter. I watched it on the vids, just like all of them. But to them, you're still larger than life. Maybe I should expect it. There aren't a hell of a lot of people who've done what I have. And now they get to meet you in the flesh. You should buy them around. It'll impress them. Yeah, let's be nice to um, to them. I mean, the ordinary soldiers, when they see, you know, a bloody icon like uh, Commander Shepard, it will be very inspiring, you know, from his end to show that he's human like them. I like the way you think, Lieutenant. Compadres, hey, the commander would like you to have a drink on him. So here's to us. Who's like us? Damn few, and they're all dead. Sorry, Shen. Thought you'd know that way. Thanks for the warning. Thanks for the drink. Damn it, morale is pitiful. The troops need something to bring back their fighting spirit. Remember the stories of the first regiment on Castellus? Outnumbered, knowing they would die. That's the spirit we need if we're going to hold power. Commander Shepard, maybe I can help. The banner of the 1st Regiment is waiting for you to pay D24. The banner of... Commander Shepard, I owe you a drink. Thank you. We'll hold that banner proudly as we take our homeworld back from these bastards. <laughs> the banner of the 1st Regiment. That should put some steel in their spine. Yeah, see him in action. That's how I ascend it to a commander position with dance. I just feel a little bit tired, that's why I'm not moving so much. Man, I like this this part here. I mean, it's very, very clever, you know, the the way they they created it. It's really nice.
I'll just leave you here for 10 seconds to appreciate it. Okay, let's make them 20. Man, the purgatory is so nice. It's almost like being on Afterlife in Omega. Alright, enough. Then it's time for business. Okay, people, if you excuse me. The commander have to close some deals, fight the reapers, save the day. I don't think that I went to the holding area in the docks. I mean, I came here, they, uh, Bay D24, went to the Citadel embassies. Uh, yeah, I didn't visit the holding area. Huh. Okay, going there. Now arriving at docking Bay E24. Emergency. Spal, Alun's doing some heavy lobbying. So he's clearly not indoctrinated. Who's opposing him? An unnamed Hanar recently posted here from Kajay. I'll check transit records for incoming Hanar. It all comes down to the war, and you trying to pull everyone into it. Would you rather the Reapers win? No. And I owe you for getting Kajay's gray box back from Hawk. But I can't do another collector base, Shep. The Reapers aren't people. I can't infiltrate a Reaper party and steal a big I win bomb. Well, that's true. I mean, she was helpful against the collectors, you know, for uh, infiltration purposes, but here it's it's all different story. She's not a soldier. Yes, we can. Tell your friends to move their ship out of the docking bay. Wait, please. My family's on board. Just let them land. I'll pay. This isn't about money. The wards are already at capacity for refugees. There's just no room. You let Asari in here earlier. That's back when we had space. Where is my family supposed to go? I don't know, all right. But they can't land here. You can't turn people away. Yes, we can. Tell your friends to move their ship out of the docking bay. Wait, please. My yeah, I support the dog officer actually because I mean, come on, there is there is no space. If they say that there is no space, then there is no space. I don't know where they they should go, but yeah. That's back when we had space. You know, if that ship doesn't clear out, the dock's authorized to fire. Right. We'll follow through if the situation forces us to. But they're civilians. And they're keeping military ships from doing their jobs. I'm contacting docking central. If that ship isn't shoving off in 30 seconds... Don't fire! I'll... I'll tell them to go. I hate this. There's just not enough space for everyone. Yep, that's why I supported the, the dock officer, because... I don't think that they're lying, and even if they're doing so, I mean... It's not up to the, to the commander to allow, you know, random refugees to, to land. Some Batarians. The council called the invaders Reapers. The same term once used by a disgraced commander Shepard to refer to theoretical 
Hello, Commander Shepard. Welcome to Docking Bay E-24. This level has been repurposed to accommodate the recent influx of civilians on the Citadel. Please ensure that you observe proper security protocols at all times while in this area. How many people are stranded here? Any personal information pertaining to residents of these facilities cannot be revealed without prior authorization. However, be assured that the facilities allocated by Citadel Council are more than adequate for current requirements. Adequate? Absolutely. Furthermore, relocations requests are being given top priority. The Citadel is dedicated to ensuring optimal solutions for all. What else is in the area? This high-security docking area was formerly reserved for Alliance Embassy deliveries. However, Councillor Udina recently put forth a council motion that it be converted to accommodate civilian emergency housing. So how did the council react? The motion passed with unanimous approval. Since then, all major races have contributed to the funding required to maintain this area. Can you tell me about the security protocols you mentioned? Due to the high influx of civilians and new streamlined processing measures, travel from this area is carefully monitored. These are merely precautionary measures to ensure the safety of permanent Citadel residents. Thanks, Avina. Please speak with me again if you require further assistance. What's your name again? Uh, Icar. Christophe Vassel. Good to meet you. How long have you been here? I don't know. I'm, I'm not in the... I don't know how long it was since I escaped Lyon. Do you know Lyon? No. I have some improvements for shotguns. All cast restrictions when making a purchase. Stand strong for your people with Batarian State Arms. So far, I don't know. Batarian State Arms, defending the hegemony. Please no, not upgrade this. I mean. Most probably, I'll be buying them on the ship um, eventually for the um, characters, you know, for the squadmates that are using shotguns, like for example Vega, but apart from him, I don't think I'll be using this mod very much. Keep on it. Some of these wounded don't have much time. Shepard. What's happening? 
If we convince the Council to accept our wounded, nowhere else to go. How bad is it? More dead than injured. 85% killed in action. We'll need a morgue soon. Not a lot of flesh wounds when you're fighting Reapers. Casualties are that high? Our frontline units are being wiped out, whole platoons at a time. A single Reaper can destroy nine or ten of them in one attack. That's not war, it's slaughter. They're called Reapers for a reason. And these guys found out why. Do what you can for them. A few of them might get back on their feet, but the rest... Sympathy is about all we can offer. Any sign of your family? Not yet, but I keep hoping. What about you? I'm starting to see some wear and tear. I won't lie. It's been rough. Well, don't forget to come up for air. There's a lot more war to go. We just got a report that another ship made it off Palavan. How many on board? 30 or 40 survivors. That's all. They said the fighting's getting worse. Well, let's find some room for them. And this is going to be home for a while. What about the food we were promised? It's been allocated to the Presidium. Then contact Commander Bailey over at CSEC. Tell him Garrus Vicarian would consider it a personal favor if he could reallocate the shipment so these people don't starve. You are looking at ZI Model 1.7 AGB, Commander Shepard. Please see a store clerk to unlock a demo of this model. You are looking at ZI Model 1.7 AGB, Commander Shepard. Please see a store clerk to unlock a demo of this You have a copy of a Shepard VI? Oh, yeah. The one based on that war hero? We locked it after some kid spilled soda over the hardware. I'll unlock it, but we've only got the demo version working. Hello, I'm the real thing, so I don't think that I'll be needing it. Wow. Arya wasn't kidding. The great Commander Shepard on a leash. I'm here for my own reasons, Bosk. Oh, sure you are. Anyway, tell her I'm impressed, but to do business, I still need my little problem taken care of. Which is? A Torian general named Oraka has it out for the Blue Suns. He's raising a stink over our activity in this sector. I'll commit my gang to Arya as soon as Oraka's dead. There must be more to Oraka's complaint. We're just making little raids along trading routes. With Arya's blessing, I might add. Oraka's just some military fossil who came out of retirement to relive the glory days and justify his existence. Losing him won't affect your war in the least, but gaining the Blue Suns, well, you know our work. You seriously think I'll assassinate a Turian general? Arya seems to think so. Or else, why would she send you? She knew the price. The two of you work it out. Oh, and, uh... <laughs> tell Arya I still expect her blue ass in bed with me. I'm pretty sure she will be impressed. What is it, Shepard? You knew about this? Darner Vosk expects me to kill General Araka. Who cares what Vosk wants? What he needs is for Araka to stop disrupting his operations. I figured you'd talk to Araka, see if you can get him to lay off. And if he won't listen to reason, call me, and I'll take care of it. I don't see the distinction. The distinction is that I'm giving you the chance to save his life. Right. Why didn't you just tell me this yourself? Yeah, he mentioned... That I'm going to sleep with him? We all have our delusions. Oh, 
Well, I believe um, he'll be sent to sleep with the fishes. Or else, <laughs> we're in the space, sleep with the stars. I've got a list of new Hanar arrivals, Bob. Forwarding it to you. On it. Maybe we'll find names there. So how's the rest of the gang? Met up with anybody else? Garrus is helping out on the Normandy. He never could pass up a good fight. What about Jacob? Haven't heard from him. See? Jacob could have gotten me back onto the Normandy. I'm touched. Well, we explored this area, so what I can do now is um, to go on the Huerta Memorial and then after that to the Presidium. Bao, here's the correspondence. If there's any mention of soul names... I've got it. A recent arrival. Zemandis. Soul name regards the works of the Enkindlers in despair. He was with the Alliance team that massacred the Batarians. He's been on special research assignment ever since. So he got his tentacles on some Reaper tech. Looks that way. I'm sending you the nav point for his office. I'll meet you there. Well, we're getting back to the embassies. Welcome, Commander Shepard. One moment. Now arriving at Presidium Embassy. Yes, I have spoken to you before. Why do you refuse to help me? Now I also check my charisma just to check how how high is. Well, it's not that bad. I cannot see how many points are, but um, you know I'm very close to the first level. It's always very important in a Mass Effect game to have your you know. Reputation as high as possible. Sightings of Reaper forces in the Celia Nebula and the Nimbus Club. Tell me you have found my son. Not yet. My apologies. Ilium is under Thank you for looking. Although the Asari colony is a Well, but I received the information for Bilal. What the Well, whatever. Zamandus? Or should I say, regards the works of the Enkindlers in despair? It seems this one has been apprehended, but confinement is irrelevant. The work of the Enkindlers cannot be stopped. Why are you trying to help the Reapers? We obtained information regarding the Enkindlers from classified sources. The Enkindlers? You mean the Protheans? Yes. As you are aware, Commander Shepard, the Protheans eventually became the Collectors, and the Collectors served the Reapers. Ugh. You have got to be kidding me. Therefore, as a faithful servant of the Enkindlers, we too must serve the Reapers. You big stupid jellyfish. You know, I support religious freedom for all species, but that's just crazy. Your skepticism does not matter. When the Enkindlers uplift us as their chosen sapiens, the galaxy will bear witness. I don't think the Enkindlers are going to be doing anything today. Your belief in your victory is mistaken. Our planetary defense network is largely automated. It can be disabled with a single virus. Which I have just uploaded. Damn it. Wait. A virus would be detected unless sent on low priority channels, which have a time lag. I may be able to block the upload. You may be delayed. Help him. I'll handle this. Got it. Uploads disabled. Looks like we're in the. Wait. He's got some kind of failsafe. Get down!
She was here the entire time. She was an old friend. I intended to arrest her. She helped me take down the Collectors. And she just gave her life to save the Hanor homeworld. Point taken. It was an honor to work with you, Shepard. When the time comes, I'll be there to return the favor. With a few friends. You can come out now. How'd you know? Lucky guess. There's no way you're recruiting me to fight in a galactic war. The Crucible Project needs technical experts. I'm not a scientist. No, but you're the best thief in the galaxy, and you can hack unfamiliar technology better than anyone. They could use your help. And think of it. All that expensive tech just lying around. It's not like they're gonna check your pockets at the end of the project. You say the nicest things. All right. I'm in. And Shep. Nice working with you again. Thank you, Mew, too, Kasumi. So yeah, we obtained Spectre Unit and also Kasumi Goto, the Hanar and Trail Forces. So more forces on the war assets, which of course will be important at the end of the game. So, um, thank you for watching, I'll cut the video here and continue on my next one. Dark Ribbon out.